all non-degradable plastics contribute to the plastosphere. And unless you can recover 100% of your plastic, guaranteed, or unless you can guarantee that it's going to find itself buried totally safely somewhere, you can't let it out into the wild. Even if you recover 90%, you still, all you've done is slow down the buildup of the plastosphere. So that says, firstly, all plastic ultimately has to be 100% recyclable or biodegradable, or in some way eco-compatible. The chemistry is not impossible. Um, if you talk to chemists who work in this space, they will say that we can do almost anything if we just decide to do it and we can pay for doing it. But it does mean that every refinery that is being currently built as a petrochemical refinery is already obsolete. 